Right, welcome back everybody. Another video on the Piaggio NRG Extreme. What we're going to be doing in today's video is hopefully putting the new drive belt on and hopefully getting this sound blasted and we'll give it a lick of paint. So let's get started. Right, so we've got the new belt here. And we're going to be putting that on but first of all i'm going to take this into the log cabin and we'll get this sand blasted and get a lick of paint on it and then while that's drying we'll come and do the belt and hopefully that should be dry enough just to get put back on the bike and hopefully we might be able to give it a little start up today as i've got a new battery as you see in the last video it's fully charged ready to go let's head in the polytunnel and get this sand blasted So we're back out in the polytunnel and that side case is just drying off now so we're going to whiz this bolt off here and we're going to take the belt off from here so i've got the impact gun there we go so just take that bolt off and then you've got a washer there just remember the way this come off so you've got the washer your bolt and you just Pull that off the spline like that, which that all looks good in there. So we can get the belt off. I have to take this back one off as well. But I just wanted to take this off just to uh, have a look at these rollers. Yeah, just as I expected. There's quite some uh, flat spots on here. Quite a few flat spots actually. Let me show you there, it's really warm. That's just uh, put a spanner in the works. There's no point putting that new belt on now. 
me needing new rollers, so I'm going to have to get a set of new rollers. Oh dear, let's put a right spanner in the works. All worn in different places, I can't get them out. There's another one. That one, that one ain't so bad actually, that one's alright. But then you've got another one there. Two flats on it. Another one there. Same again. You can see the wear marks on them. I don't know if the camera's picking that up. That one's just starting to go there. Same again there. I don't know what to do now, really, because that's put a halt to this video. So I think we're going to have to leave it here for this little Piaggio NRG video until we get some uh, new rollers. But what I've got, it, remember in the last, I don't know, maybe four or five videos ago, I had the TZR front forks. But I've managed to source another second-hand use set. But if you remember, I polished the bottom legs up. And they do look good, but it's not original. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be powder coating them silver just to give them the standard look so let me show you this is sort of the finish they are from uh, factory you can see through there's another one there but yeah and mine are, are, are polished up basically like the fork leg and it's it's not what i want so i've been thinking about it so i'm going to powder coat them silver so we might as well do that now i'm going to get them and we'll go in there and powder coat them see you in a minute right so we've got the forks here now they've all been acetoned Right, as you just see there, I've stuck them in the back room now to um, just dry off. And I did actually manage to get myself another set of second-hand ones. Uh, I'm not really after this part, it's the tubes that I'm after. And I'll just show you this. This is a good second-hand set, this. So, the odd little pit mark on it, but that's not going to matter at all. They're a lot better than what it is. And that pit mark is where actually the yoke actually sits the bracket for that. So you're not going to probably see that anyway, but we'll be splitting these forks down. I probably won't show you that again because you've seen that in the last video. We'll get the chrome tubes out and then we'll refit them back into the new freshly powder coated bottoms. And I say it's just a bit of a short mishmash video. This has we need to get some new rollers. I've actually just ordered some new rollers, but they're not going to be here till Friday the 9th of April, it's saying. So it's put a bit of a hold on that. So what I can do is I can get back on with the panels again then while I'm waiting for the rollers. So hopefully in the next Piaggio video, we should be putting a bit of color on the panels 
and I'm going to leave it here for this little video and until next time we'll see you about.